Uh, this question is a minimum difference between BST nodes. So you are given a root of a BST and then return the minimum difference between the value of any two different nodes in the tree. So basically, like you can traverse the tree and then uh, get your current node and then subtract by the previous node, and then this would be the solution. So how do you how do you sort the tree? I mean sort sort the BST tree. You are going to use the in order traversal. So pop pop the ball in order. So you need the in order. I'm going to just write the template. So if the null is actually equal to null, then basically you are you return and then you traverse the left, then you traverse the right. So uh, the idea is the idea is like this, right? But uh, what we need is we need to keep track of the previous node. So tree node three, right? And then I need to know the minimum minimum difference. So in I'm gonna call result. So I'm gonna initialize three equal to null. Uh, result equal to uh, integer dot max. And then I will just call in order for the root. And when I return, and it will return the result, right? So um, what I need is what uh, I need to traverse all the way to the left in the tree. Then I need to make sure if the tree is not equal to null, right? Then I would definitely know I I need to update my result, right? So it's going to be what the current value minus the previous value, right? And then once I um, uh, once I take I mean once I know I'm not the first the first node right so if i'm one right i don't have a previous node right but if i'm at two i know my previous node is one right because the in order traversal uh sorry the in, in order traversal is go all, all the way to the left and then go back to the parent and go all the way to the right right so so once i know uh, i'm in the parent of this one i need to know i need to update this to my previous right so I'll just say previous equal to current node. And this is pretty much it, right? So uh, if the previous does not equal to null, you update the current value for result. And let's just run it. So let's talk about the time in space. This is a space, so I would say it's constant. This is a time, right? And the time is actually all of them. Uh, it's actually the number of nodes in the tree. And this is a pretty much the time complexity so there's no other uh, there's no other time complexity in this function so uh, this is this is the solution so I will see you next time bye